All right, the last little strip. We'll be able to fit it and everything. It only took 2% of gas, of my gas, to do this, so that's not too bad. And the final little strip. I'm sorry, I'm getting excited. I'm moving too fast, I know. You don't have to tell me. Women tell me all the time. That? It's funny. Because it's true. <laughs>my friends so glad you could join me my name is Wonka and today we're gonna be playing a farmer's dynasty you guessed it we're back I'm addicted it's it I can't help it okay I can't help it but I'm gonna get you guys some other episodes as well don't worry we're not gonna binge farmer dynasty all day every day but I just had to do it over the Christmas holidays there because I was busy so it was the easiest thing for me to get out and it was the newest addiction for me so it was kind of a win-win it just worked out that way but if you have been enjoying, do me a favor, tickle that like button, leave me a comment down below. As always, if you're new here or you haven't already, be sure to punch a golden ticket by hitting that subscribe button. And enough excuses, let's just get into it. I hope you guys enjoy, and I think you will. Ah, good morning. Good morning, everybody. I don't know when you guys are going to get to see this, because I might have a few things, a few days that I've been off for. This is the first time that I'm recording again since the Christmas break, Christmas holiday, whatever you want to call it. Or just the holidays in general. I hope everybody had a good Christmas. If you did, hey, let me know in the comments. What'd you get? What'd you get? What'd Santa bring you? Huh? Something good? Anything good? If you guys tell me what you got, I'll let you know what I got. How about that? We'll trade. So today, if you didn't know, if you didn't see the last episode, which you should have, <laughs> we're, we're going to be doing some chickens and also fixing up the other person's chicken thing. Buying some chickens stocking some chickens and maybe even harvest a field if we have time we'll see so the first thing we got to do obviously take out our rusty trusty tools actually we have some nice tools they're not bad we gotta start fixing this fence all right can't have no chickens getting out can't be doing none of that stuff all right which is not gonna happen on my watch kind of hard to tell some of them are really broken and just like completely missing the fence such as this one but other ones are just more like this one which are just a little just a little broken you know? all need to be fixed though all need some love in in love and in love and war but so far so good i mean what could go wrong right it's a chicken coop this is basic stuff all right we're professional engineers all right we have engineer sight we're not just a farmer engineer we know all about structures and math and angles and gravity and calculus. Don't forget the calculus. We don't even need a calculator to do calculus. All right, that's because we're honestly, I don't know how to do calculus. So oh, there's a couple little pieces of the fence back here that I kind of skipped past. Kind of got a little too, a little too anxious to get to the coop part, the coop to the crop the cream of the coop i don't know i like these little hen doors and stuff this is cool they really they really thought of a lot of stuff with this and it's in early access so there's going to be lots of good stuff coming out they seem to be very in touch with the community they want to do what what we want as players so if you're interested in shaping farmer's dynasty you know pick up a copy put in your input on the community forums have yourself a good time with me in the farmer dynasty hashtag not sponsored hashtag why did I just say hashtag I feel ashamed now this we don't even need scaffolding I could just do it right here that's convenient small buildings they're they're great they're grrr cereal all right is this it is this the one is this the one nope this is the one there we go. Yes. Yes. Beautiful. We have fixed the hen house. So now we got an achievement for being an engineer. We have 15,000 social points, which is, I mean, we're not rich, but we're rich in social. All right. That's, that's a start. And, um, guess we can get chickens now. We got to get some food, obviously, too. 
But we, we should be able to get some chickens. Some chicka chickers. And and we're also getting closer to completing the whole the whole homestead here. We just gotta do the actual home, which we'll do soon. We gotta finish the barn. We did the roof in the tutorial, but we gotta finish that and this. I don't know which one's the barn and which one. Oh, okay, that's the barn. What is this? This kind of looks like a barn too, if you ask me. Oh, hay storage. Let's go fix that other lady's chicken coop. And then we'll go buy some chickens. And then we'll have a harvester. And chickens. I don't know where I left my tractor. Oh, right, I put it away. We should probably check on the tomatoes, too. There's just so much to do. A farmer's life is so busy. Ah, grow, my pretties. Grow. <laughs> oh. Oh, you can open them from in here. Or I could for a second. That's what these bars are for, but now I can't reopen it. Oh, well, that one's closed now. <laughs> what can you do? Ta-da! I guess we just wait on that. So, yeah, let's just go, let's just go fix another hen house. I know, exciting, riveting, back-to-back -back hen house fixing. It's great. Who closed this gate? Who did it? Who done it? Who opened the wrong gate? Who did it? Who done it? Beautiful morning, isn't it? All right. See you later. All right, Janet, don't worry. I'm coming back. And I'm going to I'm going to get your damn harvest. I wonder if I could harvest other people's fields. <laughs> Just like steal their crops. Uh, it probably wouldn't give me much social points, but you know, one man's crop is another man's crop. I love the detail on this thing. The old, like, metal, iron look. Oh, it's great. It's great. Who the hell are you? And what are you doing snooping around back here? Hey! Hey! Get out of here! I thought he actually got spooked for a second. Hey! Hey, yeah, don't be getting out your shovel now and trying to act all nonchalant. What are you doing, Matthew? Let's see if Matthew has any work for us. For work. Otherwise, he's useless. No, not at the moment. Useless! Kill him. Take his shovel and kill him. Me and Matthew, we're not friends. All right, hopefully her chicken coop isn't too bad. Mine was not great. Is my sabotage still in place? Perfect. Perfect. They haven't caught on to the sabotage yet. That means we still got a chance to get ahead, boys. And potential lady. Or two. One. Maybe none. Probably none. Go on this side of the fence and fix the last little bit of fence. Now we're trapped inside. Perfect. Now that sounds terrifying. Chickens, chickens can be angry little bastards. Come on. No? You don't want to fix that one? Okay. Say, so, hey, that's fine with me. All right. Don't let me tell you what you have to and don't have to fix. Is it just me or is it literally the same things that are broken? No, I think there was there was a bit more stuff. This was broken, though, on mine. It's like the same things. All right. Well, this thing wasn't broken in mine. I think only one was broken in mine. So, you know what? Maybe, maybe you're good. Fix another greenhouse. No. Okay, yeah. I've done the other greenhouse. Get out of here. Get out of here with that. I was going to say another one. Jeez Louise, how many greenhouses you got? You're going to take over the tomato game. I don't stand a chance. Janet, the job's all done. Now give me your shit! That's fantastic. The harvester and header are all yours. I can also sell you the seedlings cheaper if you wish. Hell yeah, Janet. She likes me. She likes me. Me and Janet gonna date. She likes me. She li earned the harvester and the grain header. And cheaper seedlings when we talk to old Janet over here. Have you finished your you task? know what? I did finish my task. This is not part of my task, all right? Claiming my reward should be none of your business. It is more majestic than I imagined. What a thing of sheer beauty. I love it. I just love it. Oh, it's great. And the header. I don't know what this thing does, but... Oh, beautiful. Oh my god, we drive this thing. 
Okay, what are those sound effects? Start slash stop spilling grain. Oh, we're moving that thing. Cool. Why? What is these engine noises? What? What is happening? Is someone washing something? Is someone taking a shower? What's happening? Okay, whatever. Let's uh, hitch the grain header. What's the other header? Oh, the corn header. Do I get that too? I get it all. <laughs> all right, well, let's take it. I'm taking the corn header and I'll be back for my grain header too, lady. God, always hungry. Always hungry. This guy, I tell you. Can't just, can't just live life without a little bit of food. Speaking of hungry, I'm kind of hungry. What should I eat? So this thing, if you're wondering, goes one kilometer per hour faster than the Jack Bear. But sounds... It sounds like it runs on windy days and mayonnaise. Now, I don't know if this is my field, but it's literally right next to my house. So I'm gonna assume that it's my field. So let's try this thing out. This is definitely looking like wheat. Um, and we've got a grain harvester here. So, what are we gonna do? Well, let me tell ya. We're gonna put it down. Down to the ground. And we're gonna hit the left trigger. And we're gonna drive into the wheat and hope for the best. It's looking good. It's looking like we're doing something. Hopefully we're not like prematurely harvesting this. What, how am I getting hungry every two goddamn seconds? Alright, have some damn fish and leave me alone. Now, I don't know how to tell when the harvest thing is full. Oh, okay, there we go. We're at 8%. So, once it gets full, we're going to have to do something. Now, what are these little lumps that I'm leaving behind? Oh, that's hay, I think. I think I can get that picked up as hay. Oh, no. Oh, maybe. I thought it disappeared, but it's just kind of disappearing every couple seconds here. I'm trying to get, like, as straight as I can because it'll make my job easier if I do this straight the first time. All right. Is it down? Oh, no. Now it's up. Uh, now it's down. Let's do it. Oh. Moving too fast, I will lose some crops. Okay, so we gotta, we gotta slow it down. We can't pedal down across the field, so good to know. 26%, jeez, this thing fills up quick. So once that fills up, we're gonna have to go get the trailer and the tractor, and then we can dump it into there. And um, everything will be good. Look at that, we're farming. How does it feel? I think it feels pretty good. It's pretty cool that we're like using this old rusty equipment too, I like that. I like that. Let's uh, let's try first person. And uh, make, uh, make sure we get all of it here. Don't wanna leave a strip so we gotta overlap a little bit. And I'm not sure exactly what speed we can we can do, but I'm gonna say 10 is probably a pretty good marker to run to live by. I feel like I'm potentially leaving like a slim line of wheat unharvested. Uh oh, we gotta we gotta stop. It's, it's full. Um, so let's get out. So when we look, okay, it's 95%. It's not full full, but it gave us a little bit of a warning. So that's that's good. I appreciate that. Now, the unfortunate thing is, is the only way for me to get my tractor back from that lady's property is walk all the way there. So, I'll be right back. Once I hop in my speedboat. What a jump. That was majestic. I felt like a gazelle. I don't know if driving over this hay is a bad thing or whatever, but... Screw it. I gotta rescue my crop. I'm not really rescue it, I guess, but you know, you know what I mean. That should be good. Let's, uh, hopefully get this to work here so move the pipe 
Should have probably done this first. Can I... Can I get out? I can't get out when the pipe's moved. Really? It's like a hill there that keeps making the trailer, like, slide, and it's annoying as hell. But hopefully this is... I honestly don't think I've played a game in my entire life that was so... That had controller support, that was a driving game, driving vehicles, and was actually better on the keyboard. It's, it's insane. It's absolute insanity to me. But anyways, we should be here, hopefully, once and for all. Could you stop moving, trailer? Like, it's super annoying. Alright, discharge pipe. In position. That should be good. That looks good. Now, start the spilling. Yes. Beautiful. Now we move it back. Hopefully that auto stops the spilling. I think so. Now we drive. Oh. Shit, now I just ruined all of those crops. Um... Good job. Good work. Well played. Turn it on, now we drive. Alright. Jeez Louise, that was a mess. Oh, sorry. Sorry, I forgot about the whole drive slow thing. Got a little angry and just kind of threw driving slow out the window. That's that's my fault. That's that's my fault. I wish I could lock in like a low speed because just like consistently tapping this is annoying and cruise control is not true cruise control. It just makes me go top speed. But this is working surprisingly well. I mean, for an early access game and stuff, I wasn't sure exactly how the farming aspect would be. And I've never personally played Farming Simulator. Oops, sorry, sorry. But I have seen it be played. And, um, I don't know. I think this is pretty, pretty dang close. Maybe not exactly as close. I think Farm Sim is obviously a little more in-depth, but this adds a whole new aspect, so kind of give and take, you know? I'm not exactly sure how to get the hay now. Now that I've harvested the wheat. I believe that's what's on the ground there is hay. There's probably another machine that I have to go get to do that, but whatever. We'll get it after. It'll be a no big deal. Yeah. That's cool how it's actually like clumping up in one area. So I need to uh, spread the love a little bit. Soon we'll dump that in our silo over there and we'll officially be be farming material. Now I'm gonna just do another line this way because that damn plow is in the way. I don't have a lot of room to turn around here. Ah, uh, it's so, I don't know, it's so pleasing to just like cut the field like that. I don't know. It's, it's, it's nice. I should have played farming games sooner. I think that might have been a much much simpler method of doing that, just drive to the trailer instead of driving the trailer to me. Who'd have thunk, right? Alright, now we've filled the trailer so we can actually uh, dump it into the silo over there. Hopefully by the time this silo fills up, I don't know actually, we gotta somehow transport this stuff I think. Or maybe we just... No, yeah, we definitely have to transport it to them. It'd be nicer if we could get a bigger trailer, you know, but... What can you do? Let's raise it. And store it, hopefully. I mean, I hope I'm not just dumping it out. Because that would suck. How do I know... How do I know if it went in? Oh, so I guess if I didn't have this trailer, I could literally just roll up every time to the silo and dump it straight in there, if I wanted to. But we're just gonna keep dumping into this trailer here, because it's easy. That's why. I'm not even harvesting crops, leave me alone. Gotta eat again, huh? Just another day of eating all the food. You know what? You can have two apples. That was probably stupid, but I did it anyway, okay? Leave me alone. 
Who do you think you are, little little patch of weight? Huh? You think you can stand up to the boss? I don't think so. All right. I don't want to. I don't want to see your face around here no more. Never again. You know, when I first started this field, it didn't look as big as as it's turned out to be. This harvester also does not hold very much. All right, the last little strip. We'll be able to fit it and everything. Only took two percent of gas of my gas to do this, so that's not too bad. And the final little strip. I'm sorry, I'm getting excited. I'm moving too fast, I know. You don't have to tell me. Women tell me all the time. That? It's funny. Because it's true. <laughs> Pipes out. And dump it. Um, put that back in. Put this up. Actually, we can put it down again because we're just... Probably, actually, we'll just leave the whole machine right over here as is. Why not? Actually, after much consideration, I want to go park it in my garage. Because that's what it's there for. And I'm excited to park my new machine in the garage. Okay. Just got to open the doors. Open the doors. And hope that it fits. It's, uh, it's going to be a tight one. Ladies and gents. <laughs> but I think we might get in. Um, okay, never mind. Oh god, this was, this was a terrible idea. This doesn't fit in the barn. So, turns out, we're not going to put it in the barn. We're going to leave it right there. This thing is intimidating. Harvest corn. And scares the bejeebus out of me. So this person has a hay wagon. Becky over here. So maybe that's how we get the hay? I'm not sure. We probably need something like a hay baler or something. I don't know. I don't know. Alright, and stored the last little bit of grain in the silo. I have no idea how to see how much is in the silo. Oh, okay. So the capacity is 50,000 kilograms. We have 7,406 in there. So not bad. Not a bad harvest, if I do say so myself. So 7,000 kilograms. And our good friends down by the mill will pay $576 per ton. So we don't, we don't got a lot of money there. That's unfortunate. I, thought, I, th I really thought that harvest was going to be a little bit more lucrative. But unfortunately, that's going to be it, folks. If you guys enjoyed, do me a favor, click that like button, leave a comment down below. As always, if you're new here or you haven't already, be sure to punch your golden ticket by hitting that subscribe button. And I know, I said I'd do chickens, but we didn't get to it. We did the harvester instead. We will 100% do chickens next time. So if you want, leave some names down below. We'll, we'll, we'll come up with some names. If nobody leaves names, I'll ask you guys again next time so you can have some time to think about names if you want to name the chickens. But remember, home is where the heart is. Or at least where you're most comfortable to take a sh- <laughs>